Hi, Miss Crow's class. I hope you guys are doing well. I hope you had an amazing weekend. Um, I miss you guys. Welcome to week six of online learning. You guys have been working so hard online for six weeks now. I am so proud of all the work that I've been receiving from you guys. We have almost every friend from our classroom on our Google Classroom now. So that is amazing. I'm so proud. You guys have been doing great work. Um, you guys should really give yourself a pat on the back for all the amazing work that you guys have been doing. So happy. Um, okay, so before we get started, uh, a few quick announcements. This week is going to be uh, a good amount of writing, okay? So week six, we're going to be focusing on our paragraph writing. So for our writing prompt, they're going to just look a little bit different. I added something to our writing prompt this week, okay? Now, what I did is now for our writing prompts, so what we've been doing is writing our topic sentence first, and then our reason, second, and then our reason, and then done. I want to step it up a notch because you guys have been doing the writing prompts like that super quick and seems pretty easy. So I'm taking it to the next level so we can improve our writing. So our writing prompt for this week looks like this. What I did is I added third so you now you have to give me a third reason and a conclusion sentence and remember our topic sentence and our conclusion sentence are basically the same thing okay so all that i did was add now you have to give me a third reason and a conclusion sentence into our writing prompts okay so our writing prompt for today is would you rather be able to control the weather or be able to talk to animals. So if you could pick between those two powers, would you rather be able to control the weather? So make it rain, make it sunny, make it thunderstorm. Would you rather control the weather or be able to talk to animals? Hmm, that's one that'll make you think. In the word box, I just put some words that might help you. Um, rain, sunshine, dogs, cats, um, any, a few words to help you out if you need them. But yeah, you're going to be thinking about would you rather control the weather or talk to animals? If you could have one of those powers, what would you have? The sentence starters say, I would rather blank. First, I would rather blank because blank. Second, I would rather blank because blank. Third, I would rather blank because blank. And then the last sentence, I would rather blank. So in total for your writing prompt today, you should have five sentences. Okay. Five sentences. All right. Here's your writing prompt for today. Get it down on a piece of paper or a Google document and make sure your writing makes sense. Check for uppercase and lowercase letters, periods at the end of your sentences. Make sure you read your writing after you're finished to make sure it makes sense. Okay. Here's your writing prompt for today. Awesome job, you finished your writing prompt for today. Now I'm going to give you your fixing your sentences activity. I'm gonna give you a hint for the fixing your sentences activity. There is a place in there that needs to be capitalized and there is a title of a book that needs to be capitalized and there's a holiday in there that needs to be capitalized, okay? So each sentence has something that needs to have uppercase letters in it. You need to find what it is, okay? Here's your fixing your sentences activity. Make sure you have uppercase and lowercase letters in your sentences. You have a period at the end of your sentence and make sure, check for spelling. Make sure the words on your paper match the words that are on the screen, okay? Here's your fixing your sentences activity for today. Awesome job, you finished your writing prompt and you're fixing your sentences activity. Okay, and big announcement for this week. It is super, super, super important that you guys do the Ed Puzzles for this week. 
And that reason is this week you guys are going to be starting your rough draft, your planning and your rough draft for a four paragraph essay. You guys, we've written a four paragraph essay in my room before. You guys know that before we write an essay, we need to plan. We just can't get a piece of paper out and write the essay, right? We have to do research. We have to plan. We have to write a rough draft. We have to edit our rough draft. And then we get to our final copy. So this week, what we're focusing on is plan researching for our essay, um, planning for our essay in a graphic organizer, and um, starting our rough draft at the end of the week. Okay, so the end of the week, our goal for the end of week six is to have our rough draft for this essay. To do the essay, we you need to complete the Ed Puzzles. The Ed Puzzles tell you how to plan for the essay and they give you a lot of great hints. So please make sure that you are doing the Ed Puzzles. What I need from you today are three things. I need your writing prompt. I need your fixing your sentences activity. And I need paragraph one the introduction paragraph of handout 8A completed in the organizer. I attached the organizer into our assignments for today. Um, you can type in the organizer. It is a Google document. So if you click on handout 8A, you can type right into the organizer. I need the writing prompt, fixing your sentences, and the first paragraph of that writing organizer today. Okay, that, those are your ELA assignments for this week. Again, send me three things. Hope you guys have a good day. Bye.